welcome or welcome back to my book sanctuary. I'm Bianca and I wanted to recommend you another series. So this is an oldie but a goodie. You most likely have heard of them before, but I wanted to recommend the Puck series by Helena Helena Hunting. So you most likely have heard of these before because they have been around for a little while, but I think they're absolutely awesome. So here we are. But they are rom-coms, so they are very, very funny, I think. And I really enjoy them. They're just basically about a group of friends who all fall in love. And some of them just happen to be NHL players, professional ice hockey players. So, yeah. Starting off with Punt. <laughs> so, something with this series that you'll notice, a lot of the girls have flower names. So Violet is the stepbrother to one of the players on the team. Alex is the captain. And Alex and Violet have a moment and then they have sort of like this one night stand. But Alex is absolutely besotted with Violet and Violet for her part is wary because she's been burnt before by a hockey player and she likes Alex but she's just wary and Alex is smart and cute and funny and sexy and keeps pursuing her and they're very very cute together and very funny and then with Pucked Up it's about Miller who or Buck and Buck is Violet's stepbrother and they have a funny relationship Buck and Violet but Sunny is Alex's little sister and she is as her name suggests just a ray of sunshine she is a little naive she is a little bit hippie-ish and Buck is yeah he just thinks she's gorgeous and he's kind of ready for a relationship finally but it's his captain it's his teammates little sister so there's the forbidden aspect there and he's not great at this whole relationship thing so he sort of has to learn how to be in a relationship with Sunny and they were just they're just very cute together and things happen and I really think it's cute. Forever Pucked. We're back with Violet and Alex with this one and basically they're going to get married. <laughs> Duh. And um, their mothers are just planning this big wedding. Violet's overwhelmed with the whole wedding planning and Alex is stressed because of work and there's a few other things going on, but mostly it's just about their relationship and them getting married and their crazy friends and their crazy life. And Violet is just nuts and I love her. Pucked over. Maybe my favorite. Lily has been in an on off relationship for a while now. And Randy is awesome and I think I might read this after we're done but I really do love this one. Randy is hilarious and sexy and awesome and his chemistry with Lily is off the charts and they are just amazing together and it's them just trying to figure each other out because you know she has been in crappy relationship on and off for seven years she is highly attracted to Randy and vice versa and yeah they're very very cute together and there's other things going on a little bit with him like I said he's a little bit damaged but yeah I really love this one Randy is one hot guy very very hot 
Then with Pop Dunga, it's just a continuation of Lily and Randy's story. So we just learn a bit more about him. It's a little bit shorter. Learn a bit about, about his father and their past. And Lily was going to be a ice skater, a, a figure ice skater. <laughs> Fucking hell, Bianca. Speak English. She was going to be an ice figure. Oh, my God. I can't speak English. You get what I'm trying to say, though. She was going to be a ice skater and because of reasons she didn't and now she teaches I think ice skating but Randy's father comes to visit and there's this whole thing with his dad and I really enjoy this I really love Randy though he's probably one of my favorites Pucked off I like this one. Lance. Lance is complicated. He's got a lot of demons. And I think her name was Poppy, if I remember correctly. Um, and she... I think she was a personal trainer. If, but don't hold me to that. But basically, she sort of... Sort of gets involved with Lance and is drawn in by him. But he's got a lot of demons and he's got this history with this complicated history with this other woman and Lance is just damaged and scarred and he's just got to learn to love himself more basically and go from there and I thought they were very very cute together I do know this is a favorite for a lot of people and I do enjoy it it is actually a lot of fun and then Pucked love this one's about Charlene Charlene yeah Charlene and what's his face I've forgotten his name Derek Dar Darren Darren I think it was Darren yep Darren Darren is Alex's best friend and Charlene happens to be Violet's best friend and Charlotte has a complicated past and is very wary of commitment and so is Darren he's very wary of commitment as well and he doesn't want to push her but they have been seeing each other for a couple of years now but they're kind of stagnant they are moving forward they're not moving backwards they're just you know so when things start happening from her past they both have to sort of put a label on things finally after a few years are they going to move forward or are they going to just not be together anymore or is it just sexual is it you know I enjoyed this it was Charlene was very complicated and she had a complicated past and I really enjoyed it but yes but the puck series I really do enjoy them I really do recommend them. You most likely have heard of them before, so if you have, let me know. And let me know if you've read them and liked them and which one's your favourite. But I think for me, Pucked Over is probably my favourite. Randy. Randy is probably my favourite. So's Alex, though, from Pucked. So, hmm, I don't know. Maybe it's Randy and Alex for a tie for me. But, yeah. I love this series, so I wanted to recommend them to you, <laughs> but that was basically just a quick recommendation for you. really do appreciate you watching, and I hope you have a great day, and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.